So in this video, I'm just gonna show you Costa de Antigua. The last video I showed you Cata de Fuste, and Costa de Antigua is the neighborhood where I live, um, which is right next door to Costa de Antigua. I'm very happy because I now have my scooter, my electric scooter, it's fixed, so I don't have to walk everywhere. But um, yeah, I just wanted to show you a little bit of the neighborhood. quiet um, like I said in my other video that there it, well, it used to be a very bad neighborhood but now we have police they come through here a lot um, the problem is we do have a lot of squatters and um, the other day we actually had an incident there were like three people they weren't from the neighborhood but they were stealing in the abandoned apartments and they were leaving like these smoke bombs everywhere and the people were worried so um, they called the police my neighbors called the police and um, they came they handled the situation and so now people are putting up cameras and things like that um, that's the only issue that we still have here sometimes is because there are so many apartments here that are abandoned. I mean, where, you know, our house, it used to be abandoned about six years ago until they decided to remodel it and paint it and do all this stuff. And that's what they're trying to do with all the other houses here. So, um, until all these houses get filled up, it's, yeah, we're gonna have this problem. There's one um, area where there's a bunch of houses that are abandoned, but only one person lives in that area. And I was like, oh, I wouldn't want to live there. <laughs> to say about living in this area is that it's um, other than the squatters it's pretty quiet um, we have everything we need here right next to the ocean there's lots of restaurants um, everything sometimes I feel like I'm in England because there's such a big um, English population but other than that, you know, I like English people, so don't get me wrong, <laughs> but it's different. Um, I would say that the only bad thing is if you were living um, here and you don't have a car, there's the bus that comes through here, but if you live on, on this island, it's good to have a car. And if you want to go to the hospital or leave this area, you have to... Um, you have to go out and it's far so it's it's better to have a car
all right guys so that is pretty much it as far as this particular part of Costa de Antigua it used to be called Nuevo Horizonte but um, I guess they took the name away but it's just like this small secluded part right next to the beach or next to the ocean um, I think that overall it's a very good place um, I don't know how bad it was before I just heard stories but um, it's a lot safer than places that I have lived in my life so I'll just leave it at that <laughs> and the neighbors are really nice too the every I mean it's just I don't know I think I like the tranquility I'm so used to living in a city where everyone's stressed and there's a lot of noise and things like that but here it's it's not like that at all I mean I can relax you know it's like if I want to go for a walk I can go for a walk um, you know right on the ocean you know what I mean and just enjoy nature and all that stuff so it's definitely um, something that is new for me but I really like it <laughs> all right so I hope you all have a great day, a great week, um, great everything, and I will see you in my next video, and yeah, that's all. <laughs> Hasta luego. Ciao.